Said you went home. Eh, Trisha. Just heard her old man died. I'll give her a call. Actually, I've been hanging around on purpose. I gotta talk to you, Tony. About what? Oh, look, I've been your consigliere for a lot of years. Don't go into a fucking preamble. Just tell me what's on your mind. You got some unhappy people out there. No shit. Not just the young guys. I'm talking about guys that have been with you since the beginning. Since before the beginning. Guys who worked for your father. Fucking Paulie, right? Nah, I'm not saying nothing. Yeah, well, goddamn him. These guys, Tom, would do whatever you ordered. Except in this case. Don't say it like that. Forget that Tony Bladetto's my cousin. I give him up, we can give the whole fucking dig up. Here's where the conversation gets difficult. Go. Oh. All due respect. You were ready to hand him your cousin a week ago. So it's not about standing with the guys or upholding some rules. Not really. Then what's it all about? Why don't you illuminate me? It's about you don't want to eat shit from John. You don't want to bow down. You told him to go fuck himself, which, to be honest, wasn't exactly appropriate, considering. Oh, is that right? With all due respect. What the fuck do you know what goes on in my head? I know you said you were a kid, Tom. Frankly, you got a problem with authority. This attitude of yours, it's a lot of what's made you an effective leader. But we all got flaws, even you. Seven deadly sins, and yours is pride. All due respect, you got no fucking idea what it's like to be number one. Every decision you make affects every facet of every other fucking thing. It's too much to deal with, almost. And in the end, you're completely alone with it all. I'm sorry you feel that way. This is the course I've chosen. And those of you that are not with me on it, well, that makes me say it. And it'll be dealt with in time. Oh. You need me for anything else? 